Calling all iCarly superfans. There's a situation to sort out. Welcome and welcome back to the world of all things film and television. If you've been a loyal iCarly fan since the show first aired in 2007, then you, like many fans, have a looming question over your head. Whatever happened to Melanie Puckett? If you don't remember her, then let us refresh your memory. She was Sam's twin sister in episode 23 of season 2, titled I Twins. <laughs> you know, one time? She tried to convince me I was adopted. We all knew Sam as the rough and uncut rebel with a mean streak, but what about her twin sis? Better yet, could the Melanie character be further explored in the 2021 reboot? Carly and the gang barely knew her and didn't even think she existed, with Freddie calling her Mythical Melanie. Okay, this sounds like a super big deal. The show never mentioned her before, and she seemed to drop off the map after the episode aired. We'll get into all that and more in today's video, so don't worry. We'd love to see her character explored and done some justice, so we're examining the psyche of the Puckett twins and their tumultuous family, and where we might see these two again, if only through name dropping. Love your dose of deep dives into the world of film and television? If so, subscribe to our channel and get ready to press rewind on the Sam remote because we're going back to the good old days. All about Melanie Puckett, Sam's strange family and fan theories. Sam Puckett has a twin, everybody, and she is Sam's polar opposite. Melanie Puckett is a prim and proper prep type who attends a fancy boarding school. Freddie, I'm really Melanie. Uh -huh. But wait, how is Sam's negligent mom able to afford that? Well, apparently Melanie is so smart she got a scholarship. Yeah, her and Sam are really different. She wears pink and pearls and says please and thank you. Some fun facts about the titular twin include the fact that she's the only member of the Puckett family that doesn't have a criminal record and that she was the first one to learn about Sam and Freddy's kiss in the episode I Kiss. What's even funnier is she kissed Freddy in the only episode in iCarly that featured her, I Twins. She had a major crush on him and she was pretty vocal about it too, unlike Sam who would rather show her feelings through violent and uncomfortable encounters. Ever seen a butter sock? Though Freddie was convinced it was just Sam pranking him, Melanie found him adorable. Their interaction at the dance club sparked shipping everywhere. Free Lanny was born. Many fans really wish the show had explored this angle and Sam's life more, seeing as she was one of the most beloved characters. If not in this show, then fans were expecting Sam's life to be revealed more in the spin-off series Sam and Cat. Fun fact, Melanie is in episode 18 of the show titled Twinfection. Here we get to see the dynamic between the girls and it's playful, light and trusting. Sam calls her in to play a trick on Cat after a silly prank fools her. They even have a twin pact, so we think the girls get along more than Sam lets on. Perhaps, like most of her life, she kept Melanie private because of her untrusting demeanor. Another fun fact, Jeanette McCurdy, who plays Sam Puckett, pulled a parent trap to play twin Melanie Puckett as well. They used split-screen technology and manipulated the mics to have audio lean more towards each speaking twin in the final elevator scene. They also used stand-ins so Jeanette could react to dialogue and movements accurately. Maybe that's why it was harder to have her in the show. That may not have been the case though, since Jeanette McCurdy revealed just how fond she was of the character. Cat, your purse, Sam. She told Tiger Beat that I Twins was her favorite episode to film. She said it was so much fun to play both of her own character Sam and Sam's twin sister Melanie. It would have been really entertaining to see an I Twins sequel. But why are they so different? Aren't they twins after all? Well, no two people are alike, even twins. But there's more to the story, so let's dig in. Melanie went off to boarding school from a young age, and so she wasn't really left around Pam Puckett's bad mothering and wasn't exposed to anger and crime as much as Sam was. She probably slept at the boarding school many times of the year, and maybe even elected not to come home unless it was a holiday. Sam stayed with her mom year-round, so she bore the brunt of her abuse, which is pretty sad when you think of it. It might also have led to her resenting her sister and not speaking about her. For example, in season 4's I, Sam's Mom, As soon as those two freaks walk back in here, Sam's mother had a serious confrontation with her daughter, asking her, why can't you be like Melanie? To which Sam replies angrily, quit comparing me to Melanie. This shows that the two have spent their entire lives being pitted against each other by their mother. That can lead to a lot of envy and resentment on Sam's end. We can assume the two have reacted to their absent father and negligent mother differently. With Melanie striving to be as different as possible. If the show had explored her further, we're sure there would have been some cracks in her perfect persona. The relationship between the twins seems a little rocky, but not too bad. The true problem seems to lie with their mother, Pam. In I, Sam's Mom, Sam runs away from home and crashes at Carly's place after a serious spat with her mom. The two come to a consensus after some hurtful mudslingings, but we never see Melanie reconcile with her mother. So will we ever see the character again? Well, the sad answer is probably not. 
Melanie was played by Jeanette McCurdy, and we all know she will not be involved in any way with the reboot. But perhaps a name drop or two would be good. Our theory and hope is that Sam's absence in the new show will be explained by Carly talking to Spencer about how Sam has moved away to spend more time bonding with her sister at her fancy apartment in London or something. The two keep in touch, but Sam is investing more in her relationship with her twin and getting rid of any toxic behaviors. That would be a happy ending for the two very stressed out iCarly kids. Well, there you have it. The tale that was never told. Are you a twin? Do you have any insight or experience as to why people think you're the same as your sibling? Because my head's jacked! I'm bonkers! Let us in on your world in the comment section below if you enjoyed this video. Then make sure you hit the like button and subscribe for more from the world of film and television. See you in the next one.